Learn Oracle Developer 11G Oracle Developer 11G is divided into three parts or three divisions. The first one is Oracle SQL. The second one is Oracle PLSQL. The third one is Oracle Forms. Oracle SQL is divided into two parts. This is the first chapter of part one. Retrieving data using the SQL select statement. Objectives. After completing this lesson, you should be able to do the following. List the capabilities of SQL select statements. Execute a basic select statement. Lesson agenda. Basic select statement. Capabilities of SQL select statement. Projection. You select the columns in a table that are returned by a query. You can select as many of the columns as required. Selection. Select the, the rows in a table that are returned by a query. Various criteria can be used to restrict the rows that are retrieved. Joining. Bring together data that is stored in different tables by specifying the link between them. Basic select statement. Consist basic select statement consists of two parts select and from select star to select all columns in the table column to select a specific column in the table distinct column to select the distinct rows that are not redundant or select the distinct rows without redundancy expression we can write arithmetic ex expression as we will take from table we write the table name we want to retrieve from it. Select identifies the columns to be displayed. From identifies the table containing those columns. Selecting all columns. Select star from departments. Let us try this example on SQL developer. Oracle program can be in the can be downloaded from Oracle website. Select all from departments. As we see all the columns in the departments table has been retrieved.
selecting specific columns select department ID location ID from departments here we don't select all the columns in the table but we select specific columns department ID location ID from departments as we see department ID location ID has been retrieved writing SQL statements SQL statements are not case sensitive which mean which means if you write it capital letter or small letter it's the same <coughs> SQL statements can be entered on one or more lines as we did keywords cannot be abbreviated or split across lines keywords like select from where select cannot be abbreviated or split across lines like writing it cell on a line and licked on the other line clauses are usually placed on separate lines clauses like select from where every clause usually placed on separate line indents are used to enhance readability as we will see next chapters in SQL developer SQL statements can optionally be terminated by a semicolon in SQL dev developer which we used before minutes SQL statements can optionally be terminated by a semicolon but if we write more than SQL statements then semicolons are required and not optional in SQL star plus you are required to end each SQL statement with a semicolon this is SQL star plus select all from departments here it's required to end select statement in SQL star plus with a semicolon as we see there is a result there is a result which is the whole table